Hi, hello. Today, um, when I was twenty, when I was twenty-two or twenty-three years old, I was diagnosed with schizophrenia and delirium, alcohol poisoning in a mental health hospital in Norway. I was diagnosed with schizophrenia because I was hearing voices. I would find great fascination of being at a hospital, being in the right hospital environment and interacting with the other patients. There would be and that the state of being at hospital being in hospital care, receiving care, became an addiction to me throughout the years. And after almost 100, after almost 100 commitments to hospital, I realized that I that it, that it had become an addiction and had to end. Uh, first, I thought that personality uh, that. First, I thought that schizophrenia is uh, like PSD, a personality disorder. I thought that, pers that, per that, the pers that uh, schizophrenia was to have multiple personalities. That is partially correct. Um, later, I learned a lot about voices and I, uh, I explored very deeply uh, with all sorts of... Uh, I explored voice in the head. I uh, use drugs, I would listen to music that would like inspiring me to investigate these voices in the head. I will take medication, I will do things to investigate about these voices. They would fascinate me quite a lot, but they would also stress me and make me fearful from these voices in my head. Now, I then thought that, that schizophrenia is only voice in the head, and that schizophrenia in itself doesn't exist. It just, I would think that schizophrenia in itself does not exist. I would think that schizophrenia in itself is just a trick to sell you drugs. And at the same time, I would think that, that, there, that the only voice in the head exists. That there were only voices in the head, there was schizophrenia, there was only schizophrenia voice in the head. Now, I realized and learned a couple of days ago that schizophrenia is the battle between the different personalities trying to embody me, different personalities trying to fight among themselves, trying to embody me, trying to become the being me myself. The different personality is struggling within conscious the mind to become me. And as the personalities fight amongst themselves, friction and voices occurs. That is schizophrenia. When you have multiple personalities that are fighting to be the one directive principle, be the one in charge, to be the being, to be the physical. Schizophrenia is that battle between personalities within oneself, where the, the personalities are trying to be the physical, trying to be the being. That is schizophrenia. And, and since you have this battle of friction between personalities, then you have voice in the head, which is a known phenomenon with schizophrenia. I just want to share this because I just realized this, that I've been living this, I've been living within this schizophrenia world and not knowing what it really was. So I really wanted to share this with you guys. Thank you for listening. I will say it one more time. Schizophrenia is personalities. You, you make personalities through your life. Through your life you develop personalities. I act according to this, I act according to that person, this person, that person. You act according to different persons with different personalities. All the time. 
This is called this is what what called programmed us from pre-programming, brainwashing. Call it what you like. This is what most of us live like. Now, uh, these personalities will then maybe fight amongst themselves to be the one in charge. These personalities will be the will fight among themselves to be the dominating figure, to be the being, to be the physical. And that is schizophrenia from personality ground, and from fighting amongst the, and from fighting within the personality systems. If you want to be free from personalities, if you want to be free from schizophrenia, check out destiny.org. Learn to work with self-forgiveness. Learn to learn with self-corrections. That is a great, profound medicine to use. A great key in life, without any doubt. Self-forgiveness is the great key in life to heal self. Self-forgiveness, self-honesty, self-acceptance, and so on. Check out destiny.org. Check out my blogs. And have a nice day.